right, hello YouTube. Okay, so I guess today I'm just gonna do a bunch of little small videos. But I got this neat little thing and I wanted to show this to y'all. It is, this is very small, like, let me show you in comparison, Dr. Pepper can. Like, yeah, it's really small. Okay, and this is a um, shopping cart cover and it can slip onto the back of a restaurant chair or if you have small dining room space like I do just on the back of a chair to be used as a high chair. Let me get this baby out of here. I'm worried about how easily this will go back in here so that's going to be part of this video and it almost looks like this is just the bag is actually part of the chair. Oh it is okay so that's, uh, that's going to be fun for me trying to get back in there. Okay, let's see. Okay, sorry. I'm trying to figure this baby out. Okay, so this is the top. It goes over the top of a chair. Like this. Yep, and then you can strap the baby, and then this folds like this, so goes like this. So there's buckles that come over here. I don't know. Let's figure this out. This almost looks like this goes around the chair. Yes. Okay, so this one goes around the back of the chair to secure it along with the top. As that's these secure onto the chair. And then does this buckle onto this? Let's see what this looks like. Okay, so it and then the baby's legs would hang right here. So you have a little. So that, that'll, um, I'm going to have to do some more investigating. It definitely doesn't look like it did on YouTube. <laughs> I mean on um, Amazon. That's where I got this thing was Amazon. And then I'm guessing I just like. How they fit this big old thing into this little bitty bag? Let's see. Do I just stuff it? Okay, so all I did was kind of turn it inside out, and I'm just stuffing it. So far, that seems to be working pretty well. So I didn't have to do any fancy folding. And voila! And it is called the sack and seat on Amazon. It was like $11. So I'm going to watch some videos on good old YouTube and see how this works. Cause it looks very confusing. I thought it was just gonna like slip over and you buckle the baby in. But on to why I was making this video. So on my quest to find a cheaper alternative to um, sets, I found these good little babies. Now, if you do have one set or you have a wristlet or something, you can take the thing off and put them, the little strap, and put them on these. They're only strap, they only have the D-ring on one side. Or each one of these sets of two bags comes with one wristlet. So that's an option you have. Um, this is the exact same size as a large set. This is the same width, like length, as a medium set, but a medium set's like this size. So you have about an extra inch. So I mean, you could just pack it only to there and fold it like this and it'll fit in any pocket that a medium set fits in. Or you could just, you know, put an extra inch of stuff in there and have a little bigger bag. And then this, is what I got for 
$2.99. Let's see if it has a brand on here. It just says made in China. Minky. So you can probably find this on Wish, but I got it at Play-Doh's Closet. Um, like where they have all the new jewelry. I'm going to use this as a small set. So I'm going to put my first aid stuff, band-aids, stuff like that in here. Um, I got two of these because I'm going to do a video packing a couple bags with these. And um, instead of uh, straps, they have little keychain things. So, I mean, the only options they had were mermaids. I'm sure if you find where they're sold originally, they have different styles, but my store just had mermaids. And then I got a second set at Walmart. Now, I've been looking and looking and looking for a alternative to sets, but I kept looking in cosmetic bags because, you know, that's, that's the first place I would think to look. These were in the purse section at Walmart by all the wallets. They were hanging up and they have so many different styles, but most of them had pink on it and I'm just not a pink fan. So these are the two I got. I'm super excited to pack a bag with these and try. Uh, I think it's going to work perfect though. I don't, I don't see why it wouldn't. I hear a weird noise and it scared me. Um, they pack really well inside of each other. That's what I'm about to do with them right now. <sighs> um, put them all inside of one. Um, now, I again, I'm just doing this video because I'm assuming there's more people out there that are like me that um, I'm just getting started on GGB. I have a pretty good collection so far, but... I just, I see sets, and I want so many sets. I want so many sets. But, I mean, even on the big barter sites, people want $40 for a full set. And, as much as I would love it to be in my budget, even if it were, I don't think I could justify it for bags that I can find on the cheap. So, I'm going to keep looking for different alternatives, too, because before I make the video, I want to have, like, three or four different options to show you. I'm gonna check the dollar store, I'm gonna check Big Lots. I checked Target, they have a couple like in the dollar section, but they're clear and they're like, mm, like plastic filling, you know, like those, you remember those plastic shoes when you were little? That's kind of what they feel like and they have that weird rubbery plastic smell that I just don't like, so, um, and those were only a dollar. So, I mean, if you wanna do that, you can. Those are a lot fatter you know like they're like half the size but then they're really fat as you can see these i mean this still has a lot of room to go um and stuff pretty full just like you can a quick oh a quick that's a really good alternative to a quick i mean and it wouldn't be much at all to add another d-ring right here and it would be just like a quick but way cheaper way way cheaper okay and i will do anything to save a penny now, I'm going to get off here, and I'm going to look this baby up on YouTube, see what I can find. I'm hoping it works out really good. I'm going to use it a few times and let you know.